Otto III of the Holy Roman Empire was born on June 30, 980, in the city of Göttingen, located in present-day Germany. He belonged to the Etonian dynasty, which played a significant role in the medieval history of the Holy Roman Empire. Otto III became the king of Germany at the tender age of three, following the death of his father, Otto II, in 983. Since he was a minor, his mother, Empress Theophanu, and his grandmother, Adelaide, served as regents. They effectively governed the empire and ensured the continuity of Etonian rule. Under the guidance of his regents, Otto III received an excellent education. He studied various subjects, including Latin, Greek, mathematics, theology, and philosophy. He had a keen interest in classical Roman culture and aimed to revive the glory of the Roman Empire. In 996, at the age of 16, Otto III assumed full control of the Holy Roman Empire. He embarked on a series of ambitious policies to strengthen imperial power and assert his authority. He focused on expanding the empire's territorial influence, particularly in Italy, which held great symbolic significance as the heartland of the Roman Empire. Otto III sought to establish his authority over Rome and the papacy. He intervened in the affairs of the Papal States, appointed and deposed popes, and aimed to create a closer alliance between the Empire and the Church. In 996, he crowned his cousin, Bruno of Corinthia, as Pope Gregory V, solidifying his control over the papacy. As a devout Christian, Otto also sought to promote Christianity and strengthen the Church. He made a pilgrimage to the tomb of Charlemagne in Aachen, which held great symbolic importance, and worked to establish a Christian empire in Europe. Otto III's rule was characterized by a unique fusion of Roman, Byzantine, and Christian influences. He saw himself as the successor to both the Roman emperors and the Christian emperors of Byzantium. He also aimed to restore the Roman Empire's grandeur and build a theocratic Christian empire. However, Otto's reign faced challenges and setbacks. He struggled to maintain control over the various regional rulers and faced opposition from powerful nobles. His attempts to centralize power and expand imperial authority sometimes resulted in conflicts and resistance. Tragically, Otto III's life was cut short. On January 23, 1002, at the age of 21, he died unexpectedly in Paterno, southern Italy. The exact cause of his death remains uncertain. His untimely demise disrupted his plans for the empire, and his legacy and vision were not fully realized. Despite his short reign, Otto III left a significant impact on the Holy Roman Empire. His efforts to unite secular and religious authority, revive the Roman Empire's prestige, and promote Christianity laid the foundation for future developments in the empire. He is remembered as an ambitious and visionary ruler who sought to shape the course of medieval Europe.